Why do we have to go through this? You hear me? I need to get the hell on. Look at me with no appetite. You hear me? My name is Chris. If you knew your hey girl, hey, it is Thursday, and of course, I am at work. <sighs> Make sure you click that like button, subscribe, comment, and share. For those who are new here, I got some new subscribers. Um, I work in medical records, I'm a health information management tech. I've been doing this for um, 10 years 10 plus years, 15, I think. I don't know, but I work at a, a rehab um, hospital here in Fort Worth and I am just at work my schedule is from Monday through Friday 8 30 no 8 to 4 30 so I got the weekends off thank God uh, and yeah welcome to my channel uh, make sure you get in the comments because I'm always in the comments as well have any questions about uh, medical records or the field that I'm in make sure you put those in the comments below but yeah girl it is Thursday and is today Thursday I'm going to get my days mixed up all week. Yeah, today is Thursday. <sighs> um, I have a lot to do. Like in the previous vlog, I told you I still had to do some filing of these memor memorandum of transfers, the MOTs. And this is a document where when a patient gets transferred, you know, the, the doctor and the CEO and the nursing supervisor has to sign the this form well I have tons and tons of stuff that I need to file and put in our little file cabinet um, it's but mostly it's because sometimes the doctors don't sign and sometimes the nursing supervisor doesn't sign and I have to take those all those back up and it takes a while for them to sign those documents and I can't scan them in into the system until they sign them so I got, I got a lot of them to file. Um, also, if you're new here, I scan in medical records charts. I do discharge analysis. Um, I make sure that everything that's in the physical chart is in the system. Um, I also fax the discharge summaries to um, the patient's PCP whenever they get discharged. I do release of information. I you know, I fax all the requested records to the physician's office, the hospitals, or whatever. Um, I don't deal with the, like, if I, if I get a request for legal stuff or social security, disability, and all that stuff, we have a copying service that handles that, and I always fax those requests to our copying service. So, that's a little rundown about my job, girl. Um, and, yeah, y'all, I'm tired. <laughs> I am tired. I stayed up to like 11.30 or so editing the video so I can um, have it uh, ready for today. Because I've been slacking. I haven't been doing two videos a week like I was supposed to. So, I think it's going to kind of be like a day in the life. I, didn't, I, I just started it. So, it's like, I probably should have started when I got up, but that's alright. It is alright. Um, but I do want to go by... Uh, this outlet store that if y'all seen previous vlog it's called AW Outlet and it's like a it's an outlet store basically you get everything for cheap so I want to go by there and then I also want to go by the Goodwill to see what kind of furniture they have because we're supposed to be having a guest um, next month Joey's girl can't talk Joey's aunt is supposed to be coming next month so we need to hurry up and get that room together and then whenever she leaves, um, I want to get my mom out here too. So we need to get the guest room 
together. So I want to find some little stands um, for the TV, you know, like a little nightstand or something for that room or a little lamp, lamp or whatever, you know, something to decorate that room. Because we're going to put Kiana's old bed in there and we already got her a mattress because she wants a full size bed. She, right now she has a day bed and it has like a trundle at the bottom. But she said she's a big girl and she wants a full size bed. So we bought her a mattress, full size mattress and it's supposed to come I think the end of this month. And we're going to look for her um, a full size bed. So we're going to put our old bed in the guest room and just, you know, fix it up. So yeah i'm gonna go there today those two places and then i'm gonna go home but this is the second day of thinner mean if y'all seen the previous vlog y'all know i started my thinner mean journey i've used it before so it helps with appetite suppressing i mean you know curbing curbing your appetite so and it's been doing this even though i'm, I'm just on the second day but yesterday girl um, I didn't eat nothing but a few Cheez-Its and I had leftover chicken tenders and green beans, which was like three, three real small green beans, I mean three small chicken tenders and a little bowl of green beans. And then I drank a protein shake and of course I have plenty, I have to drink plenty of water because you will get, um, dehydrated like I am now I'm getting like dry mouth right now so y'all yeah, already know I drink plenty of water this is my water jug <sighs> but I've been doubling it since I started um and then when I got home Joey got chicken from Tom Thumb or somewhere I think girl I got two wings and I was just picking over it because I don't know if the pills are making my, you know, my palate, you know, is different or something. But the chicken was so salty. And I was like, I can't eat this. So I didn't eat nothing. I just, I was picking all those two wings. I left a lot of meat on the bone. And I drank um, another whole bottle of water. And that's all I had yesterday. So that it does suppress your appetite. Because like I was saying in the previous vlog, y'all know my appetite was like, crazy <laughs> go watch that vlog uh, i explained how my appetite seemed like it spiked i'm not pregnant but it just yeah my appetite was ugh. i had to do something I, I had to do something about it so but yeah yeah i was just introducing this this week's vlog or this day in a life i don't know what this is gonna be <laughs> we'll see because i want to get another video out by i'm not gonna say tomorrow Maybe Saturday or Sunday, I don't know. in there um that was just saying buy me one thing i see was some cute lamps but they were twenty dollars now <laughs> i know i know i may come back and get it I'm, i just want to you know i'm gonna go to goodwill to see what they have um yeah i didn't really see too much i did see some some no show socks but they were a size they looked like it said it was a size six and it didn't give no kind of 
one size fit all it just says six and they were the Under Armour kind for five dollars which I need some no show socks because I'm constantly in Joey's uh, sock drawer drawer but all I seen was six. I was like, is that a six or is that a nine? I turned around, turned upside down to see if it looked like a nine, but it still looked like a six. <laughs> so, yeah, and all of them were a six. So, yeah, I think I'm about to go to Goodwill. My head done started hurting. I think my my little girl about to come on, child, and it's about to... Oh, why do we have to go through this? It's making me sluggish. But anyways, let me head on over here to, to the Goodwill and then I'm going to head to the house and take me, take me some pills and lay it down. I thought this was going to be like a spend a day with me kind of vlog because I was going to go to different stores. But I I think I'm just going home right after Goodwill. Yeah, because I, I worked myself to death today. You hear me? I did some work. You hear me? I was focused. I was focused, girl. I had my show on um, inmate to roommate, and I thought I was done with it yesterday, but I guess I wasn't. I was able to watch a whole. I think it had how I many? I think it had like 16 or 17 episodes. And yesterday I was just on uh, uh, episode 10 or 11. I thought that was the last one, but girl, I was able to finish that. Um, that season um they have the other season available but they're not unlocking all of them they they unlocked the a and e the a and e app y'all know what i'm talking about the um in the previous vlog i was saying telling y'all about this show that i started watching on a and e the app and i'm not paying for a and e so i have to watch it whenever they unlock the episodes so they're on un unlocking it backwards they unlocked episode five, six, was it five, six, seven, and eight? But y'all ain't unlocking one, two, three, four. So I, I was like, I don't want to watch it from the from the bottom up. You know, that's gonna be out of order. So I'm gonna wait. Um, yeah. But that first season was really, really good. It was really good. But yeah, yeah, I'm about to go. I don't know. I may go to Goodwill. I may not. I'm going to talk to y'all later. Oh, hey, y'all. Happy Friday. Y'all know I did not make it to Goodwill yesterday. I did not. I did not. My head was hurting all freaking day yesterday. Um, it really started bothering me when I got off, but I was trying to I was trying to push through because I wanted to go to the Goodwill. I went to AW Alley, but I was like, I'm gonna go to Goodwill, girl. I love AW Alley, and I was like, oh, I'm going home. Oh, it was pounding to the point where I just needed to close my eyes. But I don't know if it's from I don't know if if I was hungry because y'all know I'm taking that pill, and I only ate like. Um, Y'all know the administration um, has like a bunch of snacks in their department and we're the uh, employees are welcome to get snacks out of there anytime. They have healthy snacks and they have like junk food. So I chose the healthy one. Um, I chose the veggie puffs. They're like chips but they're puffs. And I think it was like 50 or 60, 70 calories. I don't know. And then I had some had beef jerky. I think I had like three of the, the little mini beef jerkies and I had my premier protein that I forgot to bring today and I had that and of course tons of water but I was not hungry you know all day so I was like maybe my headache is from that but so um but I'm thinking it was it's my period because I know how when my period comes on this the first thing that comes is, is a headache. So when I left A.W. Alley, I was like, girl, let me stop by this store and get me something because I'm feeling like, I don't I, I don't feel hungry, but my stomach is like, I don't know. It's just doing something weird and my head is hurting. I was like, I need to eat something. So I got me some juice and I chugged that and my stomach started to feel better. So maybe I was like, maybe I'm just hungry and don't know it. <laughs> but I made it to the house. I didn't take no shower. I took this wig off. I took the makeup off. I took my clothes off and got in the bed and I slept all night. Yeah, I slept all night and today I feel so much better. Oh my God, I feel so much better. <sighs> because I woke up with a headache, but it was just 
just a small headache you know it wasn't that bad and uh yeah i feel so much better today um I need to find somewhere to put y'all because these little sticky pads they don't stick on the top of my dashboard um being that when they clean my car i guess they put whatever they put on the on the dashboard is making these sticky pads not stick on the dashboard like i want it or maybe it's just the sticky pads i don't know so i got i got y'all on my tripod now since i'm parked but the little sticky pad is like in this little console part and it's a different fabric a different what you call it child i don't know and it sticks right there but i don't like the angle so i don't know child i'm gonna have to um uh, i'm gonna have to do something i'm gonna have to put my badge or something right here because you can see my bra but yeah girl let me um go on in here and get started and start my day so I can get the hell on. You hear me? I need to get the hell on. When they receive information, let's say it from a crew. Okay, y'all. Girl, I don't like this angle. You hear me? I do not like this angle. But this is the angle for now. <laughs> Even though it's making me look big, you know, showing all my chins and everything, you know? But I am headed to. I think I'm headed to Walmart because I want, I'm on my lunch. I want some fruit. I had thought about like a acai bowl, but that's way down, down there. <laughs> so I was like, let me just go to Walmart, give me a bowl of fruit and I don't know, something to, I don't know, something to snack on. Because that's what I want. I got to taste for some some watermelon mm -hmm. girl these people be driving oh child these people be driving crazy i gotta test with some watermelon so but i kind of want like a cucumber feta salad or something i don't know am i on the right side or what the hell is going on <laughs> but i want something you know i don't know at the cafeteria, they, the menu said they're having um, a nacho bar, but I know how that meat be tasting, so I ain't no need me even going in there. I mean, being that we got a new chef, I don't know, because I don't think she's made the, the nacho bar, but I know that meat, it just, yeah. And that cheese, I don't know what kind of cheese they use. It ain't the government cheese, because government cheese is good. I don't know what kind of cheese they use, but it is not good. So I ain't want to be disappointed. Girl, you don't y'all see me driving? Child, they just walking all slow across this parking lot. And didn't even wave and say thank you for letting me cross or nothing. They just kept walking. All slow. Market till they come red carpet the kids success still the target soon i'll be crossing that bridge but can't bring everybody with me family only i got some people think i owe a favor barely know me that's why my focus on the road is all i know i see the stick and close to play the wall and watch my growth because i got something they never had so get on the beat and i need a hell of a pad i float and fly you know where i'm from so it comes as no surprise i just out with a mean vernacular dream spectacular i keep a queen and passenger fl capital y anywhere i am jam that's for sure Turn me on, better set the mood from the dope. That's just how it go. Glad I've been keeping it playing so long. Out here in this world, I feel it in a place that I could moan. But ain't nothing like you when I'm at home. It ain't nothing like you when I'm at home. That's why I came out stepping. I can't be doing things regular for you. I want the magic to last. I know how time try and ruin things. It get repetitive. Got Okay, girl, I done messed around and hit the slow mode on my camera. Um, yeah. But all I was saying is my little jewelry thing dropped on the floor because of the command strip. I guess it old or whatever and it fell off the, off the wall. So my little jewelry case, hanging case or whatever it is, fell off the wall. 
and we're just getting back home from you know browsing the stores we went to so many freaking stores to the point where i was like okay it's time to go home because it's so hot it is hot you know hear I me mean? but one thing that i've noticed um those phenamine pills that i take girl i got a lot of energy i could have stayed about a little longer but it was just a little bit too damn hot and i couldn't do it but yeah we um browsed some stores uh we was going to see if anything jumped out of the, jumped out at us and if it did we bought it um we bought a few, few things and i'll have to show y'all later but um yeah girl this dog on slow camera <laughs> i can't believe this normally i would catch it but i didn't i did not and then some of the stuff that uh when we went to at home girl was so expensive i'm like how am i gonna pay a hundred two hundred dollars for a damn picture who who about to do that true enough it was a big big picture but i ain't gonna pay no two hundred dollars for no picture i ain't i'll just wait um to shop online or go to the goodwill um yeah girl at home prices are ridiculous but yeah girl um i didn't have nothing today to eat well i did i didn't okay let me let me back up i had we went to firehouse sub and i got like a small i didn't get the normally i would get the medium turkey bacon ranch but i got the small and i'm so proud of myself small um turkey bacon ranch sandwich miss vicky's vinegar and salt chips and some water I'm so proud of myself and we also went to this coffee shop called 151 um and i got like some sort of energy drink that joey tried yesterday and i didn't take too many sips of that because y'all know the pills that i take and then with that energy drink girl i've been off my rockers so one thing about those pills that give you energy child i mean energy and i'm loving it my uh doctor's supposed to be putting me on some other pill i forgot it starts with a t i put it across the screen um so my appointment is august 6th and she's gonna put put me on those also and i think those kind of um uh, suppress your appetite too but it also you know kind of tells you when you're full so she's gonna put me on those also so i am excited about this not eating because if y'all know me i will get up and i'm starving i'll have a cup of coffee i have breakfast i will have some chips um yeah normally when we go out we will have like some snacks we'll go by mcdonald's and get like a sausage mcmuffin for breakfast and then two hours later i'm getting some chips and beef jerky and all of that so i had not even snack today so i'm so proud of myself but yeah y'all that's, that's what this clip was about nothing really and i'm so pissed off <laughs> but anyways i'm gonna talk to y'all later Monday, child. When I tell y'all, I did not pick up the camera yesterday. I did not. I got a little frustrated Saturday when we got home because when I went to edit, and then towards the end of the video, child, tell me why I was in slow mo. It was in slow mo. Like, <laughs> oh, um, 
luckily it wasn't much but I, I must have accidentally pushed slow-mo while we were in Home Depot and at home because we went to a lot of stores y'all I mean oh went to a lot of stores and Home Depot and at home was the one that was in slow-mo and then when I got home I was trying to tell y'all about um yeah I was talking then but I was like you know what I know how to take the slow-mo off but I don't know how to take the slow-mo off on a video that I, I've already done and I tried to google it but it keeps telling me how to do it how to take it off but I want it off the actual video that is already done I know how to take it off when I'm recording or about to record but I need to know how to take it off the video that's already done but luckily that was the only part that was in slow-mo girl I was oh. Normally, I would catch it. Oh, I would catch it. Like, I think it was all... This is the second time this happened to me. The first time, I think I was just doing, like, some sort of B-roll. So, it was kind of easy to, you know, speed up the, um... Speed the video up. But, I was talking in one part. So, it's like... So, yeah, girl. I did that voiceover and I was like, you know what? I'm done. I'm done. I ain't picking up the camera no more today. Or yesterday so I didn't <laughs> I was like oh my god oh I was hurt oh I really wasn't hurt but I was just a little oof. yeah and then I was gonna put a video out yesterday but I realized it is just too short and then I ain't, it was like 20 minutes <laughs> or 18 minutes or something I don't know so I was like, let me keep going on today but today is Monday start of a new week y'all I've been working my little tail off today. I kind of got unfocused for a little while. But 11.30 came quick as hell. And uh, let me tell you about my appetite, y'all. I ain't eating nothing. <laughs> I didn't eat nothing um, yesterday. I didn't eat until like... 1.10. I didn't have nothing. I had water. Because me and Kiana was kind of um, busy around the house and I wasn't hungry. Um, we were talking about cleaning the the fourth bedroom because like I was telling you earlier, Joey's aunt is coming next month. And we had, we cleaned it out before, but it, we had left like Chris, our Christmas stuff. We had blankets. Joey had all his tools everywhere. Um, we had just boxes and totes and we said we was gonna hurry and you know clean that out but we didn't know which day we was gonna clean it out but kiana couldn't sleep that day saturday sunday morning so she got out real early and all i heard was like some change it sounded like change i was like okay well maybe kiana's up not knowing that she was in the room in the guest room cleaning cleaning it up <laughs> She had got so far when I when I uh, woke up, I went in there and she was putting her dad's tools in his little toolbox, just because it was like screws like laying everywhere or whatever. And she was picking them up, and then you know she she started. So I was like, well, let me get me a cup of coffee, and I'll start in the living room, you know, clean up the kitchen and all that stuff. So. <clears throat> around like an hour or so I went in there and we literally we got it done like the room looks brand new <laughs> I mean we moved totes we moved she moved actually the Christmas stuff put in the closet and we could have all my uh our winter clothes in there too and she did it girl she was on it when I tell you she was on it she started it but I helped helped her finish it so that room is completely clear all that's in there is the lamp that we bought and from um, Home Depot and then she vacuumed everything so it looks so good and new um so we'll be putting Kiana's bed in there and then we're supposed to be buying like a little chair and a, a little table or something to go in there too and we gotta put up some curtains so yeah girl uh I didn't eat until 1 o'clock 1 10 and I was just uh, Kiana, not Kiana but Joey had went to go get some stuff at street tacos because he will make street tacos and normally when he makes street street tacos he would make his own guacamole and his own salsa so I was test taste he wanted us to test taste the, the guacamole and the salsa so I didn't eat until 1 10 test tasting stuff 
110 y'all know i would have had a chip in my mouth some cereal some coffee something so i'll admit these pills are really really helping me uh with my appetite i am so and then when when i ate the street tacos when they were done i have three and that's it and some water the whole day i think i got done eating at five o'clock and the rest of the day i didn't have nothing else Girl, I was like, what? <laughs> Look at me with no appetite. You hear me? Girl, I just don't know. I don't know what to do. But this morning, I had coffee, water, of course, and then I had some cheeses. Probably like, what time is it? 11.46. I think I had that around 9, 9.30, which I didn't really need, but I felt like I need to put something in my stomach since I haven't had anything to eat since 5 o'clock yesterday. So, that's all, girl. I ain't had nothing else. <laughs> My mouth a little dry, so I need to uh, chug some more water. But, yeah. I'm pretty excited about this not having an appetite. You hear me? Oof. <laughs> Wonder how long these pounds are going to take to drop off. You, girl. Yeah. But it's been working, and I'm excited about it. Um, yeah, I probably could have fasted this morning. I probably could have. But I was like, Chrissy, you know you need something in your stomach. You ain't ate since 5 o'clock yesterday. So, I fasted for one day. Intermittent fast for one day. Shoot. That's good enough. I'll probably do it like a every other day kind of thing. I don't know. We'll see. Lopsided. I guess because y'all sitting on this bed. Oh my god. Girl. So I just got to eat some street tacos. So good. Only had three. Um and some water. <laughs> I had um a little protein bar. A granola bar at work and some water and that's it but i got these little headbands because y'all know i like the wide headbands and i can't find none for cheap put it that way and i seen um jenny janine she said she ordered these off amazon and i was like well let me give me some because i can't find none but cheap i see some that's one for one is ten dollars or nineteen dollars or fourteen dollars i'm like girl mm -mm, i ain't paying all that money that but oh they come with ponytail holders too they come one two three four five six seven eight oh they come ten in a pack um am i gonna use these colors i probably should have got like a more like i know i probably use the black the blue the gray and the brown I don't know if I'm gonna use these colors, but I like to wear like because this is on backwards. It has like a little knot at the well that's supposed to be in the center, and I always turn these headbands to the wide part because I don't know my head just to be to wear like the little small thin looking ones. So I got these and they come with ponytail holders, and these are. I had to make sure I ain't got it in slow mo because <laughs> oh child mm -mm. I am too through okay these were only $8.83 $8.83 for for 10 and then I got these lip glosses I love these lip glosses they keep your lips all moist and glistening like Purchase chicken and they come how many in a pack? Is it ten? Two, four, six, 
eight. Yeah, ten a pack for nine ninety nine, and it they are the Broadway Vita Lip Clear Broadway Vita Lip Clear Lip Gloss, moisturizing, hydrating, and nourishing. All right, and then I got. Okay, let me tell y'all about these. These are some magnetic lashes. I had ordered um, some magnetic lashes from TikTok shop from Hold on. Okay, I ordered some um, some magnetic lashes from TikTok shop from Porterfly. And I realized probably like right after, probably like a good hour, it was less than that, probably like a good 20 minutes um, after I ordered it, I realized I put the my apartment's address on there. So I tried to go in there and change it and I couldn't. And I reached out to the, the company and they were like, um, try to track down, no. I thought, well, okay, let me back up. I tried to change it, but I couldn't change it. So, the shop app, y'all know it, um, did I go through the shop app? Yeah, y'all know I have the shop app, and it'll tell you, like, the destination or when your package will be delivered. It'll give you all the time, time stamps or where it is or whatever, or whatever. And... I went in there and I was like, I seen that it was still at my old, my, the address is still at my old apartment address. So I changed it in there thinking that it would change in the Portafly, whatever the brand name is called, in their company or their website, whatever child. I, I was thinking it was going to change in there. So I didn't think nothing of it. So a couple of days later, I ended up reaching out to the company. And they said it had already been shipped and they can't do nothing uh, about it or whatever. So I ended up waiting until it got delivered to my old apartment. Called the receptionist desk because that's where they said they left it at. They left it at the receptionist desk or in the mail room. Called there and she said it's not in the mail room and they didn't bring it to her. I'm like, you got my package, don't you? I know you do. <laughs> so anyways, that was a good... $25 gone to waste because I ain't got them. So the company finally reached back out to me. I was like, um, the receptionist said she didn't get it and it's not in the mail room at my, you know, old address. But they haven't reached back out to me. So that's the story on that. So I ended up just ordering on um, Amazon. They're the natural ones. So I don't know how they're going to look. I hope they're the natural. The one, the ones off the website, off the company's website, Portafly, they were the exact kind that I wanted. It didn't look like it was too much, or you know, so I don't know what this is gonna be giving. All right, let's see how these. Look. I like these. I don't know. I feel like that's gonna be too much. I don't know. Girl, I don't even know how to put them on. But they come with a little magnetic thing. I try them one day. I don't. I might end up cutting them, <laughs> trimming them, trimming the edges a little bit. Cause I, I, I just don't want them to be like. You know. Girl. Oh. Child. I had to figure it out later. I put it on once I, I probably put it on this weekend sometime. I don't know. But yeah, these were, 
after I done spent twenty some dollars on the porterfly, these were nine ninety nine. So just a try out, you know. I normally don't wear lashes, but I wanted to try it out, you know. I think I wore lashes one time, and that was when we went to South Padre Island the first time. Yeah, the first the first time we went to South Padre Island, I wore them, but then I ain't wore them no more. <laughs> so we gonna try them out, y'all. But let me um start editing. Put some clothes in a dryer and fold some clothes. And yeah, I'm gonna talk to y'all later. This may be the end of this vlog. I don't know. We'll see. If I don't come back on, y'all know it's the end. Thank you guys for watching, subscribing, commenting, sharing, liking. And make sure you come back. Tell your friends, give my friends so we can be friends. We're almost at 3K. Almost. Um, it's taking a little bit too long. But I know I gotta be patient. Let's see. Oh, we at 2,976 subscribers. We're almost there. But yeah, y'all. I'm talk to y'all later. Oh, Goodwill did not have anything. Goodwill did not have anything. And Goodwill did not have anything. Like, yeah, they didn't have anything. So, um, I only looked at the, the, like, the stands or whatever. I didn't look at nothing else. I didn't even go to the clothes section. Or they had a little sandal section. It looked like it was new. Like, new sandals. I didn't even go in that area. But, yeah, y'all, I'm going to talk to y'all later.